the Emacs E8 controller does work on Apple computers. However, there are a couple of things you should be aware of. So if you're having problems, just take a deep breath, remain calm, and I'll show you exactly what I did. We'll be using the free Curry Kitten FPV simulator in this video. And unlike Windows, this controller is actually plug and play on a Mac. The cable that Emacs sent with this controller won't work for simulators since it's only for charging and does not transmit data. After connecting a data cable, the controller showed up in this simulator. When I did a stick calibration on an Intel Mac, the roll axis failed. Moving the right stick left and right just didn't work. The green light on the controller indicates that the radio is in D16 mode. After changing it to D8 mode, the problem disappeared and my roll axis worked. So if you have an Intel Mac, put your radio into D8 mode by pressing and holding the L1 button while turning on the controller and it should work. If you have an M1 Mac, both D8 and D16 modes seem to work fine in this simulator. Thanks for watching Ready Set Drone. I'll see you next time. And remember, don't fly alone.